madness, huh? <laughs> There's carne asada. Check it out. Wow. Chef Big Dog up all night cooking. Shut up and taste this, some amuse douche. Come here, guy. Look at that. You like it? Yeah. yeah. We're going to cook like this. We're being reviewed by the most important critic in the city. Now suddenly you're going to be an artist. Well, be an artist on your own time. It's my restaurant. The kitchen is my domain. That was our deal. The deal has now changed. Either you stay or you go. So you're threatening to fire me now? No, I'm telling you what I'm prepared to do if you don't cook my menu. It's up, it's up, the review's out. His dramatic weight gain can only be explained by the fact that he must be eating all the food sent back to the kitchen. I didn't like what they wrote about you. I don't like it either. Who cares? I do, because I could have done better. I should have cooked food that I was going to cook. There are chefs that cook food that they believe in, and people will try because they're open to a new experience, and they'll end up liking it. Hey, 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 what are you doing? This don't guy. do it. What are, you, what are you writing? Chef, don't. That's not a good I idea. Said, Just listen. I won't send it until we all say it's okay. Why don't you come by again tonight? I got a whole new menu just for you, asshole. Oh, no, no, that's man, not good. Give me the phone. Give, give me the don't, phone. Don't do it. That's out there now. What happens? Why would you do you that? You can't take that back. Dad, did you post anything since last night? You gotta be kidding me. Wow. You realize how many people have read this? You're trending, bro. You're never going to be happy cooking for someone else. Food truck's a great idea. We're talking about a white-on-white, 88 Chevy Grumman food truck. It's a blank canvas for your dreams. I'm gonna have him pull it around. Thank you. Don't thank me till you see it. So what are you gonna do? You're gonna laugh. Tony, Carl's got a taco truck. For real? <laughs> I was so jealous when I heard your voice. I was like, that's what I want to do. Get to touch people's lives with what I do, and I love it. And I want to share this with you. What are you doing? Dude, I'm putting a little cornstarch on my werewolves, man. It's too humid down here. Dad, wake up. I'm just putting cornstarch on his balls. You want some? It's like baby powder. It's nice, right? Nice.